So it's not like I need to say it. Golf is hard. <laughs> My name is Kenny. You may know me as Kenny Cat. I'm on a journey to get better at golf, and not just better, I'm trying to shoot level par. And hopefully my story will inspire you and show you a few things along the way of what I'm going through in my struggles that maybe help you better your game. If you haven't already, please subscribe below. Thumbs up this video if you do like it, or give me any comments, let me know what I could be doing better. Uh, this is the first time I picked up a club in about a week or so. And it's just simply because the last lesson that I had with the coach, you know, it, it was a good lesson, but there was just a lot of stuff in there that had to really get worked out. And we worked on a new movement. And the reason why is because typically I hit my balls left to right with a bit of a fade. It's more of a controlled slice, but it's, it's for all intents and purposes, let's just call it a fade. What I've noticed with that is there are days where, let me get on my knee. There are days where I'm either on and I can control it and like, you know, you can find target with it and you get shots that look like this. And then there are other days where it is completely uncontrollable and it's like that timing is off by like a split millisecond. And we're only talking about a few degrees here. And that's the difference between me hitting a six iron, you know, to the right of a green or hitting a six iron completely out of bounds because it's moved, you know, 25 yards left to right. So we worked on it with the coach and we worked on a movement mechanism or a movement mechanic or a swing movement or however you want to call it that can calm down that path and I absolutely hate it. Like, I genuinely hate it. And I just had to admit that to myself. Like, I'm being a baby about it, but I hate it. It feels unnatural. It feels extremely uncomfortable. The shots are doing completely different shapes of what I'm used to. And I realized that I caught myself in the exact same habit that I think a lot of people get into after they have really tough lessons. And this is why I think, you know, uh, a lot of people don't get better at it. And my coach put something on his channel that was pretty cool where, you know, he talks about the reason that golfers haven't gotten better is because people haven't gotten better or people haven't changed. Like no one wants to be uncomfortable. No one wants to be struggling and frustrating out here in 104 degree Phoenix sun and trying to work out this new movement to calm down a directional miss. But that's the difference of being better at golf or just staying exactly where you are and stagnating. So I just got finished with a grueling three hours of practice and it feels good. I've been very frustrated with the reality that it's gonna take some time to make new changes. And I know everyone talks about going through swing changes and they talk about changing their new swing and like the reality of it is, this is something that's gonna take years, if not longer. Like it'll be functional and you know, a few months of working with it and like a few months of practicing at it you'll be able to find target i think probably you know if i'm practicing an hour or two hours a day i would say maybe in three four months it'll be very functional back to where my scoring stats are now but as far as it being like my go-to movement that's that's gonna take years like easily years and i think we just fall into this trap of thinking that it's gonna be so much easier than it really is and it's not that easy like this is a sport that's mastered by people over decades like some of the greatest players in the world have been playing this sport since they could like walk that's just kind of where my head was at overall though uh, I think I'm doing pretty good I'll try to do like a, uh, a, a week by week swing capture to kind of see like where the swing is moving because it's like it's very minuscule amounts I looked at it on a track man it's like one two to two degrees at most I think it'll be interesting to see how it changes and how it progresses week to week to week month to month to month so that's something I think I'm gonna do that's all I got for you deuces let's keep it moving <laughs> 